Today is a big day for Annette. She'll be taking the driving license exam. All the night spent studying about roundabouts, lane changing and parking will finally pay off. By the end of today, she'll be allowed to drive, but she seems a little stressed. It's a similar big day for Niels. He has dreamed about driving cars since he was a kid. He even used all his savings for taking extra classes, just to be sure. Maya is our third examinee. She studied the books and her driving package hours like everyone else, but there's something else she did on top of that. She spent over 40 extra hours in the driving simulator working on her weakest part, parking. Oh my, Annette is not doing too well. She already missed so much. In the middle, we see Nils doing a good job. He's almost finished and he did not make many mistakes, but there's still room for error. Our last candidate seems to do fine. She has practiced this so many times that she knows most of the roads by heart, almost like a taxi driver. Can you imagine how much it would have cost her to take so many extra classes? But right now, let's concentrate on how well she's doing. Almost done. Oh, there it is, the parking test. You, you go, go girl. girl and bravo. We have a new driver. Niels is also done. The examiner is now going over his notes. But it seems... Yeah, yes, he, he passed. passed. Congratulations to Niels. Unfortunately, things are not looking so good for Annette. Sadly, those limited classes were not enough to gain sufficient experience. In order to have the highest chances of passing the test, one needs to invest extra resources like time and money. Let's make a simple calculation. One extra driving hour is 500 Danish kroner. Statistics say that 25% of the students take five extra hours. By using a realistic VR simulator, a student will cut down the cost of his education, but it's not about the money here. Students could use the simulator according to their own schedule to tailor practice according to their needs. We have a working prototype of this simulator, but we need your support to bring it to the market. Please support us in creating safer roads.